In this video, we will learn how to connect Focus 61 controller to Toolstalk BLM. First step is, of course, to connect an Ethernet cable in the Focus 61 controller. We will use port 1.2. And then the same Ethernet cable goes into the PC. We can now start Toolstalk BLM. We need to right click on it and run as an administrator. We will see that to connect, we simply have to click on the connect icon and the list of the Focus 61 controllers connected on the same network will appear in here. If we don't find our controller, we can always click on search devices. After the search has been completed, the list will be updated and we will see our controller. What is important now is to take note of the IP address of the Focus 61 controller we want to connect to. In this case, it is 192.168.1.60. We need this number because in order to connect, we need to be sure that our PC is on the same network of the Focus 61 controller. To change the network settings, let's right click on the network icon here in the system tray and open network and sharing center. We need to identify either Ethernet or local area connection and click on it. From here, we click on properties and we select Internet Protocol version 4, TCP IPv4 and click on properties. Now we have to set the IP address of the computer, so we click on use the following IP address and we have to select an address which is close to the one of the Focus 61 controller. I will use 192.168.1.55. I cannot use, of course, the same IP address of the Focus 61 controller. I will just change the last number here. After I fill in this field, the subnet mask will be automatically filled in by Windows into 255, 255, 2550. I click on OK, I close it. I can now connect to the Focus 61 controller by clicking on Connect and selecting the Focus 61 controller I want to connect to. Focus 61 controller will start the communication with Toolstock BLM so that all data present on the controller will be sent over to Toolstock BLM and I can start working on it from Toolstock BLM. <laughs>